There is a mysterious underwater realm where nature has set aside all restraints. It is a world riddled with labyrinths and chasms. Predators lurk hungrily and swarms of animals, large and small, filled the sea with spectacular combinations of color and form. Fish create a shifting three-dimensional kaleidoscope, while sedentary creatures of every color and description weave a living Persian carpet beneath them. Here, even the rocks are alive. The brittle thickets of staghorn coral and undulating sea whips are part of this unearthly cast of characters. Here, where many animals look like plants, surprises await at every turn. There are female fish that begin their lives as males. And snails that are both male and female at once. There are colors that advertise and colors that conceal. Brilliant colors that seem to exist simply to dazzle the eye. Even the living structure of the reef, made entirely from coral, perpetuates itself on cues from this clock, in a silent dance of life that occurs but once a year. Corals built this enormous three-dimensional labyrinth. Corals are considered animals, but they're not typical animals in any way. What we identify as a single coral is really a colony, each comprised of hundreds or thousands of tiny individuals called polyps. These polyp communities feed at night. Arms outstretched, they catch and strain food from water moving past them. But as the sun rises, polyps draw back into the protection of their limestone skeletons. For the rest of the day, these hard corals act less like animals than like plants, protecting their delicate tissues from the jaws of enemies yet unseen. They spend the daylight hours capturing solar energy with the help of single-celled algae living in their tissues. The algae also enable their host to secrete the limestone that forms the structure of the reef. This intimate partnership helps make possible the incredible density of life here.